Today we're going to take a quick look at the new Top Don BT300P battery and system tester with a built-in printer. Designed with advanced technologies and conductivity, the tool is very accurate, user-friendly with step-by-step -step procedures, and an absolute pleasure to use. As soon as you hook the tool up, the screen turns on and gives you a few choices. You can pick cranking test, charging test. We're going to pick battery test and go ahead and hit the enter button. Regular flooded, cold cranking amps, and adjust it to our battery. You can go down or up, and then go ahead and press enter for the test. And that's the results. 100% healthy, charge is 100%, internal resistance 4.87, which is low, rated at 600 cold cranking amps. And now we're going to go ahead and print the results. And that's it. After printing out the results of various batteries around the house, you can see them side by side and get a good idea of how accurate the BT300P actually is. The first test was from a Fusion, a one to two year old battery. The tester said good battery, health was 100%, and internal resistance was 4.9. And I'm assuming that's, that's a good internal resistance because it's a pretty new battery. The second test was out of a truck that hasn't been run in a while. The battery was purchased in November of 2018. The charge was only 41%. It said good recharge. The health was at 27% and the internal resistance was 9, probably because the battery is getting a bit old and it needs a recharge. The third test was out of a boat. It said replace battery, even though the charge was 100%. The health was 50%, so I'm assuming that's why they said replace the battery. And the internal resistance was not that bad, 6.2. And finally, the snowmobile battery. I don't have very good luck with them. It was 5 to 6 years old. It wouldn't take a charge. Although it said charge and retest, it would not take a charge. The health was 5%. It only had 8 volts and an internal resistance of 20 and that is pretty high. Next, we'll run the cranking test. Scroll down, hit enter, and it says, please start the engine. And the tester says cranking is normal and provides the time and voltage. Last, we'll run the charging test. So we'll scroll down and hit enter. And first you have a ripple test, which basically checks the diodes. You don't want any spikes because that says a diode might be going bad or diodes might be going bad. It says increase speed to 2500 Keep it for five seconds. And then press enter. And those are your specs for the charging test. The Topton battery tester has a printer built right in and that's also very easy to use. Just tip it sideways and the roll comes right out and you can just tighten it up a bit and it comes with three rolls. You just set it in there and close the lid. When you're ready to print you just hold the enter button until you hear it to start to print and then let go and it'll print out your results. The Topdown BT300P is very user friendly, accurate and a pleasure to work with. I hope you enjoyed this video on the handy portable battery tester from Topdown and if you did and you'd like to get my latest videos don't forget to hit the subscribe button.